So I noticed a little issue with our gamepad navigation. If I go to the end and I keep tapping right, then I gotta tap left a bunch of times in order to come back. And if, same thing on the other side, if I tap left a bunch of times, I gotta tap right a bunch of times before it'll start moving. And that's because we're incrementing and decrementing without checking what number we're at. So we're gonna do some clamps real quick. We're gonna give them the clamps. So over here, when we're updating everything, let's just grab all of this. And we're gonna clamp. So right off here, we're gonna clamp the integer. Actually, I guess it's on this side. So we will plug that right there. And then afterwards, we will set our selected item index to this clamp. And what we want is our inventory size minus one. Since we're working with an array, we'll plug it in just like that. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. So here, we're going to clamp max is the inventory minus one and then we'll copy and paste this right here so we can plug it in and then feed it in so let's check that now tapping left a bunch of times but when I start tapping right it immediately goes tapping left All right, that's working. And I thought about it. Some of y'all might have bigger inventories. So we're going to go ahead and set up the up and down portion so we can jump down or jump up. It'll just, it'll just be easy. So we're going to go into our project settings. Into the input settings. We'll add two more action mappings. This will be menu nav down and menu nav up so for the down is d-pad down up is d-pad up and then now we can jump over here so we'll do menu nav menu dave <laughs> menu nav down I mixed up the words together in my head menu nav up and then basically we're gonna do all of this the same except instead of incrementing so let's copy this and paste it right here but instead of incrementing we'll take this selected item index control C control V and then from the menu nav down we will subtract four from it or however many so I have one, two, three, four on my menu thing. One, two, three, four. That's how many you'll do, however many. So there's that. Plugged in right there. And then from the menu nav up. No, no, menu nav down is, is the negative. So on the top, when we're moving up yeah, I should have put the up up here and then the down <laughs> when we're moving down we want to add 4 to it and when we're moving up then we want to subtract 4 but just like that we should have everything we need for let me jump in Yeah, and it automatically jumps to the end. So if I press down, it'll automatically clamp to that last number. So it, if you press up and then up again, it goes to the first, very first index. So, so now we can kind of up and down, move around, make it a little easier instead of having to go right, 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 left, 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 left. Now I can snake it around. Sweet.
All right. So in the next one, we'll start setting up some some more item use functionality. So I will see y'all there. Bye.